I really wanted to go into chemistry because I like the fact that science can sort of tell us how the world works. Chemistry is interesting because it lets you see how real life applications come about from molecules on a micro scale. I chose chemistry at Warwick because I liked the idea of the MChem project and I loved the modules. I'm a problem solver and there's so much problem solving in chemistry that I just thrive in it. The first year was very focused on getting you up to speed on everything, whereas this second year is a lot more kind of splitting off into different sections. There's a huge range of organic, inorganic, physical, analytical, there's all sorts of things. Then in year three you can specialise a bit more and choose more of what you want. I'm doing the Masters of Chemistry with International Placement and it's structured similar to the Masters of Chemistry except in the third year you go abroad. I went on International Placement to Singapore. That's something I was looking forward to the minute I got to Warwick. It just expanded my horizons, opened up so many opportunities for me and I got to also explore the country. Fourth year is an integrated master's, so you do a project with a researcher. You get to choose your own projects, you choose all the modules you do. The undergraduate labs are great, and it feels like you're working in a proper lab, like it doesn't feel like you're an actual undergraduate. Practical chemistry is a huge part of the chemistry degree programme, and the students here spend one to two days a week in the teaching lab. We try and ease them in gently, so from the start they get some intra labs that try and get them familiar with the key techniques. Then we go on to the main lab experiment they're a bit longer, a bit more involved and use the techniques they've just learnt. And then towards the end of the academic year, we get them doing some mini research experiments. My favourite module has been the polymer module. In third year, it's where you really get to do the in-depth stuff. You need to get to do the material sides of it. You need to see how polymers are developed, how they're used. My favourite module has been the fourth year electrochemistry and nanotechnology module. And it's a great insight onto how small molecules can affect uh, the electric properties of many different compounds. And that's useful for applications right across the board. So my favourite module I study in second year is statistical mechanics and electrochemical cells. I particularly enjoy the maths aspect of chemistry. That module speaks to me in quite a profound way because there's a lot of maths in there, but also I enjoy the physics-y parts of it. My favourite module was the energy module in year three. We we'll learn a lot about renewables and photovoltaics and it's so interesting because these things are on the market and they were developed by the academics who are teaching them to me. I think organic's really interesting. I like organic synthesis and I like the way that you can build a molecule up from a few steps. I love organic synthesis, but I'm also doing an energy module, a pharmacology module, and a module on polymers, and I love them all. I love learning how these are applied in everyday life. A lot of lecturers like to use their own research, which is really lovely because then you get to see where the applications are. I think one of the most important things is to put some direct relevance into a lot of the theory that they'll read in books or they'll see in lectures and if you are taught by somebody who uses that theory on a day-to-day -day basis in their research then they can not only show application and relevance but they can add additional examples, additional context. For me the best thing about studying chemistry at Warwick is the academics and as cheesy as that sounds it always surprised me how they they just have time for you. It's a really friendly place to be. It feels like everyone knows each other, even the academics. It's quite nice when you walk past someone and say hi and they actually know your name. It feels like a little family, or a big family actually.